Well, let's return now to our big focus this evening, Telangana, on a day in which hundreds of trains were off the tracks. It's all part of a massive agitation which has begun in the state once again. Several renewed calls for the creation of the new state of Telangana. Is the center looking at what's happening in the Andhra Pradesh region? Well, is the dream of Telangana just that, a dream, or is there a realistic possibility that India might end up with a new state? Joining us, Mr. K.T. Ramarao, MLA of the Telangana Rashtra Samiti and son of uh, KCR, uh, someone who's, who began the movement in a sense uh, just a few years back. Of course, it's been there for several decades, but really gave it the thrust with the creation uh, of the Telangana Rashtra Samiti. Also joining us, Keshav Rao, Congress leader, and joining us from Vijaywada, Mr. Rajagopal Lagadapati, uh, a Lok Sabha MP of the Congress Party, but somebody who's in the anti-Telangana uh, camp, as it were, in the Congress Party. Sir. Mr. Katie Rama Rao, to you first. Sir, your Rail Roko campaign may have been successful today, but for several months, ever since the Sri Krishna report was submitted, Telangana seems to have disappeared from the national consciousness. Would you agree that your movement is losing momentum? No, absolutely not. We gave uh, the union government ample time. After the submission of the Sri Krishna committee report, we were told by the Congress High Command and the UPA government, uh, in the powers to be in the UPA government, and our friends in uh, Congress from Telangana, that uh, we have to wait until the elections are over in the five states. They got over, I believe, on the 13th of May, and it's been four months since then. We waited very patiently till May 13th. We waited for the union government to come forward and take a decision, which hasn't happened. And on, in July, in mid-July, we've served notices to the state government here saying that all the employees all the employees belonging to the Telangana region are going to be, go on a strike and so are the RTC employees and so are the Singareni colliery employees and so are the people. So the general strike that is on in Telangana today had been served, uh, had begun with a notice that has been served about two months back. Right. So we've been on this agitation path ever since the Sri Krishna Rem Co committee has submitted its report. To say that the movement has lost its team is something, uh, something that's astounding. From the, because, national uh, from, perspective, what we see, from the national the perspective is what I'm asking you. In all of the national debates happening now, whether it's 2G, whether it's the fight within top Congress leaders, whether it's the entire Anna Hazare struggle, Telangana, which was a dominant national issue as well, has been relegated to being just a regional issue. You need national support to make this your agenda, which is what you seek. Uh, Vishnu, which, which is ironical because... Uh, we believe that it was the national media that actually highlighted Anna Hazare's cause or uh, the 2G case as well, which was spearheaded by the media, yes. media activism really. But unfortunately for us, Telangana somehow seems to miss out on, uh, the, uh, we somehow don't seem to figure in the good books of national media. Therefore, there was a lot of resentment as well. In fact, uh, our lawyers here have striked against the national media offices in Hyderabad as well. But we are glad that you are uh, finally having this discussion. We're glad that you're finally getting us back onto the national stage. We want answers from the UPA government because we've given them ample notice. Right. The movement has been gaining in strength from, from, from the time uh, Sri Krishna Committee had submitted its report. But so far along, the, the UPA government okay. had not come forward with a clear-cut stand on what they would like to do. Okay. NDTV's Cricket app, Android and iPhone, faster scorecard, special analysis, and much more. Download free ndtv.com slash apps.